Hola, in today's lesson we will continue with the sounds and the spelling of the Spanish language. We will specifically focus on two letters, G and J, and two different sounds. One, we will call it strong, and the other one, soft. The first one, it is G, G, and the second one, J. J. G is G in Spanish and J is J. As we said before, we are going to distinguish between two different sounds. The combination of G and A sounds a ga, and that ga we call it soft because we will compare it later on with the sound ha, which we will consider strong. Go and go. Actually, this is the same that you would have in English. But let's see some examples. First one is gato, a cat, gato. Gota, drop, gota. Agua, agua, water. The strong sound, on the contrary, would be produced with a combination of a G and an E, and it sounds G, and also an I, G, G and G. Notice the difference between the strong G and G, G and G. The examples here would be gente, people, gente, strong sound, gente. Página, página, page. The combination of G, U and E, it is a soft sound. What it means that if you add a U between the G and the E, it softens the sound of G and it becomes G. And the same with I, G, G. You shouldn't be very surprised because it's the same in English when you say things like guitar or gorilla. The examples here in Spanish, the obvious ones are guerra, guitarra, J has always a strong sound attached to it. So, it is easy to remember, whenever you see a J, you just connect it to a strong sound. Jamón, jamón, ham. Jirafa, jirafa. The things to remember here are that the letter J and the combination of GE and GI always have a strong sound. And also that G A G O G U Ga Go Gu are soft. <laughs>